What's going on, everybody? My name is Andy Stripper, 93, back at you for like Satan Review. Hope everybody's doing well. Um, so yesterday we reviewed the Eli Garrett, and I gotta say it's not bad. Um, like I said, I definitely compare it to um, Copenhagen stuff. It's not bad. And now you're going to be reviewing Grizzly Long Cut Natural. So first and foremost, Grizzly's now doing their new Candizam look, and I actually do thoroughly love that. I think that was really cool. Um, I'll give the Candizam a 10 out of 10. So Grizzly Long Cut Natural, um, it's been one of my favorite dips. It's actually my favorite natural dip. Um, you can almost pick this up ev anywhere, um, it's an almost because it's a very hard dip to find, I must say. Oh yeah, oh, we got four. It's not too, too bad. Um, so believe it or not, this is actually the same as this. This is my Garrett. For tobacco wise, it's 90% in the United States, 10% imported tobacco. So, not bad. Nice, right, same great dip, new grizzler can. Hell yeah. Alright, here's what it looks like. It's not bad. Okay. Now, this is long cut natural, so. Ooh. It's nice and moist. That's a good thing. Nice, nice. We're going to go ahead and give ourselves a healthy pincher. Pincher. Rooney Dooney. <laughs> Just look at that pinch ability, man. 10 out of freaking 10, ladies and gentlemen. That is so freaking awesome. It's just, it's nice and moist, which is an amazing thing. That's what you're looking for when you want to grab a dip. Um, got the fucking, my wife's hair is there. I swear, her hair is fucking everywhere, dude. It's horrible. Okay. Cheers. Not bad. Mm. Mm. Nice and dark. Mm. 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 A little folder in there, but not too crazy. Hmm. Wow. Um. I will say, out of like Grizzly Wine Cut Natural and Grizzly Snuff, I always go for Wine Cut Natural because it's amazing. Um, personally, for me, I like Grizzly Wine Cut Natural over Copenhagen Wine Cut Natural. Um, mainly because of price, but I feel like Grizzly Pinch is better than Copenhagen does in their natural, so. But not bad. Mmm. I also forgot to mention that uh, I would choose Levi Garrett Snuff over Grizzly Snuff as well. Um, like I said, they're both made by American Snuff Company, which is awesome. Because for the most part, that's what I mainly dip is American Snuff Company. Um, 
mainly because it's just like they're good in price. Yeah, amazing dip. High quality nicotine and you know, I pinched that like last. Well, this is actually really, really good. Um I remember when I first started dipping yeah, Grizzly Nolka Natural is called Grizzly 1900s. And that was some good shit. Like, you know, um, I would say over the years, Grizzly Nolka Natural has always, always, always been improving. And since Grizzly's done a new look, um, I think it really makes a can stand out. And I gotta say, I do thoroughly enjoy this. You know, um, I'm not a big fan of their Grizzly Straight anymore. Um, just because. You know, it's definitely not something that, um, I would dip every day. Anyway, my buddy Ohio Dipper, he, he fucking loves Grizzly Straight. I, I don't really anymore. Like I can, I can take it or leave it. Same time with grizzly mint. Yeah. Um, I'll tell you my two favorite grizzlies are is uh, grizzly wonka wintergreen and grizzly wonka natural. Those two are freaking amazing. Um. I also like about Grizzly Wonka Natural, it just stays in one pocket, it doesn't move around too much. Um, amazing flavor. You know, um, you do spit a lot with this stuff, so I recommend to keep a mud jug or spitter nearby. <laughs> um, it's weird. When I was dipping that Grizzly, I mean, when I was dipping that Levi Garrett, snuff yesterday when I was waiting for the video to upload I was waiting for the video to upload fucking so and I was going wicked dry all of a sudden I was like huh that's an interesting but with this stuff oh that's not the case that gets a thumbs up for me um last stability I would probably give this an hour you know, to be honest, um, like I could sit here and play like, you know, on my PS5 and sit there and just game and probably would like clearly forget it was in. <laughs> you know, that's, that's definitely really cool. Um, how long did the play roll last? Honestly, I, I gave it like a half hour to 45 minutes, but. That's a half hour, flip it over, and then you get another, like, 15 minutes out of it to match, but it's still not bad, you know? Um, on a nicotine level, um, you are going to feel it, but it's not too overpowering. Um, yeah, but has it improved, yes or no? I'm going to say yes. And it... It's just a very awesome dip to enjoy. And, uh, you know, this is like a H3 and A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August. So, August of 2023, and here we are in like January of 2024, and so spitting black and everything, man. Awesome. Mm hmm. I, uh, I definitely do recommend this tip. So, overall, reading a Grizzly Wonka Natural, from my opinion, I'm going to give it a 10 out of 10. On an average opinion, most people would give it like an 8 out of 10. Just for reasons. But, I like it though. Anyhow. Shout out to the Ohio Dipper, Brazilian Dipper, Zuckerberg. There we go. Now. Let's see. Tennessee Romeo and 
the Wisconsin Farm Boys too. Jason Trustee Wilton and Josh. And that'll about do it. Alright, folks. Hope everybody has a great weekend. It's Friday. Um I actually got a surprise. Last night I went to Walmart and I bought like three twenty four packs of beer. Some Baja Blast and Gatorade. And that right there is either for tonight or it's for Saturday. So we'll see. Anyhow, guys. See y'all on the dip side. Send it.